Hi, tip number three, you have to visit your doctor. You need to go and check out your body because you need to know whether everything is working the way it should. Now, I know this can be a really scary process because you know how your body feels. You know when there's something wrong within yourself if you listen closely to your body. Now, you do need to go to the doctors because whenever I work with any client, the first question I ask them is, have you had all your checkups done? So what are some of the checkups that you need to make sure you get you get done? You need to check whether you have any cysts, any, any, whether you have endometriosis, whether your, your uterus and your, your lining inside your uterus is healthy because all of these things help to be the perfect home for your baby. You also need to check up whether your ovaries and your fallopian tubes are all clear. Because if you have any blockages in your fallopian tube, then that egg that you produce will never be able to reach your uterus where fertilization takes place. So please make sure that when you do go to the gynecologist, they need to be checking your hormonal levels, whether your progesterone and estrogen are all fine, because if those levels are not right, you need to be able to change your diet, which we'll talk later on, and you need to be able to do certain things to get those levels back to balance and back to normal. Now, when it's not just the females that need to go to the doctors, you also need to make sure that your partner is tested also, because there's a huge problem with sperm production, with the mobility of the sperms and so on, which I will be talking uh, later. Now, if you want to fall pregnant and you want to start a family, then these checkups are vital. When you know that your body is working fine and there's no physical issues in your body, then you will know that it becomes a mental issue where that can be sorted out very, very easily using some of the techniques I use. Now, let's look at male reproductive uh, and uh, fertility. Now, sometimes males don't believe that their bodies may also not be working the way it should. You know, there's so many factors that contribute to infertility in men. And it could be childhood accidents that could have caused it. Um, where I, I've seen a few clients where the male clients have hurt um, They've had fallen when they were younger and they've hurt their testicles and this has caused some form of problem in their sperm, um, where the sperms are actually produced. Now, some of the other problems could be, firstly, not enough sperms. The sperm counts are very low. You could also have... Uh, the shape of your sperms very very abnormal and you may even see that sometimes you have clumping now clumping is when sperms actually just stick together and uh, during ejaculation the sperms are not easily able to flow into the body so you need to make sure that you check up on that also the shape of the sperm if the sperm is not shaped well it will find it challenging to actually swim and uh, during fertilization. So these are all the things that you need to check up because if both the male and the females know that their bodies are working fine, then we know that we can sort out the mindset because the mindset helps to get your body kick-started into working the way it should so that you and your and your partner can become parents and can start a family. It's such a beautiful feeling when you know that your body is working well. And when you work with me, we work with diet, we work with um, the way your body is responding to suggestions. I use hypnotherapy, I use NLP, I use rapid transformational therapy, and like I said in my other videos, we go to the root cause of the problem. Now, when we were born, we were born with perfect bodies, but somehow along the line as we were growing up, 
our bodies started to react to our emotions and the stress that we have in our lives. And that is why when we get into the times of adulthood where you want to start a family, there seems to be certain problems. So guys, make sure you go and get those, that, those tests done. Make sure that all the hormones are working perfectly and your body is working the way it should so that pregnancy can come to you and you can become a mom or a dad. Lots of love from Nirasha Ramlugan from Just Simply Change. Chat soon.